All right, Meals on Wheels Western Michigan is dedicated to making sure seniors in our community are fed and taken care of, serving 450,000 meals annually in Kent and Allegan counties. But in the middle of this pandemic, the need is bigger than it's ever been. Deanna Falzone joining us once again this morning with the work that they are doing. Hey there. Yeah, good morning to you guys. So they say they are fielding hundreds of calls right now daily from seniors looking to sign up to those that re already receive their services concerned that they're not going to get what they need. But Wheels on Meals reassuring me that they are working tirelessly to make sure that those needs are met. So Meals on Wheels Western Michigan served about 30,000 meals last week and say they are seeing an increase in demand like they have never seen before. So to give you some perspective, 70% of the seniors they serve are low income or below poverty level. So this is what they depend on. And to make sure they have what they need through all of this, they delivered 1,800 emergency boxes, which includes 14 meals. But again, that need and demand is growing every day and they say they are so thankful for the community and businesses that have stepped up to make sure some of the most vulnerable are taken care of through all of this. Our primary focus is to continue getting our nutritious meals to homebound seniors to help keep them safety safe and independent. Uh, we're still delivering meals and we have no plans to stop. The people that are receiving these meals have no other resources, so it's really critical um, that we keep going. Because again, this is what they really depend on. And two things quickly I wanna mention. The first, they have already received reports of scammers trying to take advantage during this time. People going to the door saying that they're from Meals and Wheels, asking for money for their services to be continued. They will never do that. And another thing just to put into perspective, obviously they make sure these seniors are taken care of with food, but they also have assessors that go into their homes just to make sure that they have what they need. And one woman didn't have any toilet paper. She's like, it's fine, it's fine, I'll get by. Well, they went out, got some toilet paper, dropped it off on her front porch, and they said when they did that, she just had tears in her eyes, just so, so thankful that someone was looking out for her and making sure that she was taken care of through all of this. So just the littlest thing makes a difference, and it just goes to show that working together is really, I think, what we all need right now. So if you want to help, just head to our website. We'll put a link up there with some resources for you.